What's happening, guys? Welcome to another Quick Tip Tuesday. Man, I love this Quick Tip series. You guys loving this series? Let me know in a comment down below. Today, we're going to be talking about another one-click option. I love doing things quick here in Resolve. One-click option on how to match a color grade from one clip to the next. Now, last week, we did talk about matching color grades in one clip, but there we were talking more about matching the look of an image. But this one-click option today is going to show you how to basically take all the nodes that you set up copy it from one clip to the next, and we're gonna do it in one click. Now legit, this one is one click. But first, if you are new here, and you like to learn a little DaVinci Resolve, consider subscribing to my channel. Just, uh, just hit the little icon in the corner there, or the, the little subscribe button. You know, one of these guys, hit that. I would love to have you as part of the community. Jumping right into Resolve here, I'm already in the color tab, so make sure you're in the color tab. I have my first clip graded here. This is the way I want it to look. If I turn it off, you can see the before and the after. Now, I wanna take this grade and apply it to my other clips. Here's how you do it in one click. Select the clip that you wanna apply the grade to, and then come back to one that's already got the grade on it, like mine right here, and middle click the mouse button, middle click, and it's gonna copy all those nodes onto the new clip. Boom, there you go. Real quick, one click, it's easy. Now let's say I've got a whole bunch of clips and I wanna copy to all the clips. All you gotta do, select all your clips, come back to a clip that already has the grade on it, and middle click, and it's gonna copy all those nodes onto each one of your clips. Boom, there you go. Now, how do you know if your clip has the nodes on it? Well, look at the top left-hand corner here. The little number will have this little uh, rainbow uh, symbol around it, and that means it's got a color grade applied to it, or it has nodes that has adjustments applied to it. And just for fun, as a bonus tip here, I film on a 5D Mark IV. I also film on a 60D, a GoPro sometimes. Sometimes I've got other footage in my timeline. So when I'm color grading and I want to be able to use this technique to just apply a color grade to all my 5D Mark IV clips, for example, here's what I do. I come up here to clips, and I created a smart filters. So I'm able to sort all my clips and have just the 5D Mark IV clips show up. So I don't have to go through my timeline and pick all the different clips. I can set it for 5D Mark IV, and I mean, that's all I have in my timeline right now. But if I, if I had more clips, I could select this option with the smart filter, and it's only gonna show me the 5D Mark IV clips. I know I color grade them all the same. I can select all of them, middle mouse click, boom. I just applied a fast color grade to all my clips. So it's super handy super helpful, and it's only one click. So that's it, Quick Tip Tuesday here. Guys, if you learned a little something, go ahead and hit that subscribe button for me. Hit the like button too. Give that algorithm a little boost for me. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.